Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspies CaseBreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Panini Flawless Collegiate Football One Box Pick Your Team Number Four. It's for the Tots, ladies and gentlemen. For the Tots, toys for Tots. I think you saw our little thing that we've been doing here. We're donating a bunch of toys to the Tots, and you're helping out too with every toys for Tot break that you fill, right? I think we we set it so we can get a certain amount of net profits from this break, which we're putting towards the toys. And then on top of that, if you sell out this break, not only do we take the profits from the break, but we ourselves add another 500 on top of that. It's a total of, I think, $5,000? Yeah, there it is. Right, so so it was a total of $2,500 for, uh, for the breaks themselves, and then we added another 2500 on top of that. $5,000 for the tots. Thank you everyone for helping us out if you join these breaks. We only have one more break to do. That's our final Toys for Tots break. So if you want to help out the Tots, get into that, jazbeescasebreaks.com. It's a hoops break. Um, there's no checklist for Flawless Collegiate, so we're going by the uh, our no checklist for college rules right here. So if they're an active player, they'll go to the team they're currently on. Brady goes to the Bucks. Stephon Diggs goes to the Bills. Le'Veon Bell goes to the Chiefs. Um, or the team they played for the longest if they're retired. Montana goes to the Niners. Emmett Smith, Cowboys. Um, a tiebreaker will be um, will be games, and then tiebreaker will be games started after that. We'll use ProFootballReference.com. Okay, with all that being said, big thanks to all of these lovely people for getting into the action. One box, pick your team four. Jeremy with that last spot mojo, Vikings. And there were a bunch of RNB number block teams here. So all of those teams will go in this number block break only for that particular case right there. You can kind of see everything on one screen right about there. All right, and there's Pick Your Team 4 right over here. Good luck, everybody. Come on, Jared Stidham. Let's see Jared Stidham get a... So we're watching Thursday Night Football, Patriots at Rams, and Rams are cruising. I think they're up like 24-3 or something like that. They've put Stidham in the game, fourth quarter, handful of minutes left. It'd be good for the hobby if Jared Stidham, four minutes left, kind of orchestrates a nice little drive here, but it's already third and four. Come on, Jared. Stidham back to pass, dropped. All right, so you can see the encased, the three encased cards right over there. Ooh, what's that big G card over there? You see that? All right, let's do this box first. All right, first one out of the gate is Dual Relic LaMichael Pirine. 13 out of 15 for the Jets. That'll be for Adam and his Jets. 14 out of 25, we got Steven Montez. Where is Montez right now? I feel like I should know this, but... I'm blanking on where Montez is at. Oh, he's Washington, Washington football team. Undrafted free agent. Actually, let me let's make this easier for the shipping team and tag all of these. So that'll go to the number block. And that'll be Washington 4 right there. That's the number we go by. Washington 4 is going to be for Andrew B. Here on his jet. Thanks, Core. All right. Next up is 25 out of 25, two color jersey and autograph, Jonathan Taylor, Colts. That's going to be for Sean Maddock in Indianapolis. Ooh. Oh, this is a nice patch right here. One out of five. That's my guy. 
Henry Ruggs the third. Old Ruggsy, the speedster. One out of five. Who's got my Raiders? That's a number block team. Raiders one. Oh, so Adam Adam Copperman with Raiders one. Adam's a Jets fan in last week. Adam, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Sorry, Adam. I, was, I looked over there and I was like, oh. Yeah, can I cover and cover this guy. Yeah, he's like, who? This is what it looked like from this angle. It was just like. Robert, I expect that to break tonight. So let's sell that out. We got two color, dual relic, and autograph. Lights, Camara action in his Tennessee gear. Nice dual diamond, dual relic autograph. Who's got the Saints? That'll be for Matt Medlin and the Saints. We've got an old school guy here. I think he's... A purple team. Yes, he played with them for 12 years. It's Alan Page. 16 out of 25 from Notre Dame. Spent 12 of his 16 years with the uh, Minnesota Vikings. There you go. Was he part of the... Uh, part of the Purple people eaters, maybe. And then he played with uh, with the Bears for four seasons in his career. Uh, Minnesota Vikings, Jeremy T. With that one. We got six out of ten. Oh, these are the relics. Joey B. Six out of ten for the Bengals. Adam. And then we've got five out of five. I think where did where did he end up? I think he is with okay. It's with the bird team. And we got a five out of five. Nice dual relic there, Jared Pinkney. Who's with the Falcons? Corey with the Dirty Birds. There you go. Nice. Five out of five. Corey, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! All right, now we got three in case cards here. This one looked really cool. So we'll do that one and that one, and then we'll see what that one is. On the right side is a train whistle. It's Brian Edwards, three out of five emerald. It's kind of hard to see the green in there, but trust me, it's there. These look really nice in person. Raiders are a number block team. This time Raiders three. Uh, that would be Kenneth. There you go. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. <laughs> All right, the card in the middle is usually an autograph. It's going to be, ooh, nice for the Cowboys. 8 out of 25, CeeDee Lamb. That'll be for Alifonso. Got the Cowboys straight up.
And this little card tells you that they're, uh, these, all the gems are naturally mined, not lab grown. Ooh. Oh. This is a randomizer, folks. Look at this. Have you ever seen that? Oh, yeah. Just the team? I pulled uh, the Oregon Ducks one like that. One. Oh, that's, that's right. That's right. But this was just a team one, so I think it's... Uh... I don't think there should be a player at the back, though. There could be, though. Yeah, there's no player on this one. So it's a randomizer. Everyone has a chance at this. Georgia fans. Ooh, Georgia fans would love this. So it's kind of hard to see, but you've got one, two, three, four, five, six rubies right there. You can see the red there, and one, two, three, four, five, six diamonds right there, too. Wow, some Georgia fan is going to really love that. And if you're a Georgia fan, maybe you're really rooting for this too. That is awesome. All right, well. Good luck. They are indeed. That's what it says on that card. Wherever that went. Anyway, that, that's what it says on that card that I just showed you. They are real. Okay. So here's, here's how we're going to do this. Let's flip back to the screen right here. We're going to randomize teams. Now, if the, random, if the team on top ends up being, for example, the Rams, then it'll go to Rams 1. So Adam's rooting for a number block team to hit. All right. So let's copy all the teams here. Let's put them in right here. New dice roll. Team on top after eight. Four and a four, eight times. Hard eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. After eight, 31 sad people. One really happy person, and it's going to be Green Bay Packers. Green Bay Packers on top after eight, and the Packers are a number block team. Packers one, Adam. There you go, Adam. Adam Coverman. All aboard. Whoop, whoop. Nice break for you, and a nice break in general, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks, everybody, for getting into the action. The case is closed on 2020 Panini Flaws Collegiate Football. Pick your team number four for the Tots as well. So thanks for, uh, thanks for joining, and thanks for helping out Toys for Tots with us. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.